it's January the 2nd, 2018 and this last couple of weeks, all over Christmas, I've eaten too much sugar and I can feel it so I've decided to cut out all my sugar, all the bread and everything. So. I've got for one of my or two dinners which is some steamed broccoli and this is another one of my things okay this is really actually that's got broccoli in it but I don't know whether to have anything in with it but also got go ahead I can't really see it it's the word is, I've got two boxes this is um cocoa and hazelnut it's going to be really over, but there you go. And the other one is cocoa and orange. And it's got no sugar, no gluten in it. And it's only got seven ingredients high in fibre. But there's four in the box. I've got two boxes. So two tonight, two tomorrow, and two on Thursday. And also, also got some spice nuts. Which is another thing so that's my diet oh yeah and I've got mackerel to go with my dinner which is oh mackerel's so nice it's lovely and then let me just put my thing in so yeah so I've come to pick Josh up and the weather outside is so nasty it's just falling down rain rain go away come back another day so I just went into Sainsbury's and I thought, oh, some headphones, half price, go to the thingy, full price, Ooh, save me some money. I've been debating whether to get them for ages, but I decided not to get them and they're full price and I couldn't bother to wait around and see if they are half price because obviously it's raining outside and I've got to come and pick Josh up. And uh, I, if he starts early, I try to phone him at five o'clock. Oh, I forgot it was six o'clock. And he has to start. It takes him 50 minutes to get from my house to where he's, he's just biding some time. And uh, I phoned him up. He said, it's all right. I said, I'm on my way. I thought, well, okay. So he can get out. He doesn't need me. And uh, I slept really well today because I made myself go back to sleep. But I'm in a crossroads, I don't know whether to leave my current job or just stay there and wait and see what happens. I'm so not, I don't know, don't know what to do. Because I could work down the road and I could walk there. But then would I do days, three long days a week? Or would I not? Would I do them all in a row? Or would I not? But if I do go for this other job, I'll go and see if I can get one. It's all the girls what I used to work with. But I'd do days. 100%. I'd do three long days, 36 hours. But I'd want them to do them all together, not separately. I wouldn't mind doing... Oh, you see... The trouble is with me, I do a lot of fitness. And I have certain fitness regimes in. And if I change my job, then... I will have to change all my training routine. Oh, I don't know. It's, it's just ridiculous at the moment. I don't know what to do. Well, I might as well just stay there. It's not a horrible job. But there's none of the people are there what I, I work with. I mean, one of my, my sweeties little girls are gone. She went this morning, gave her a hug. She's only young, but she's so nice. I get on so well with her. And, uh, oh, I don't know. You, you're in a dilemma. Dilemma, dilemma, dilemma. But we'll see what this year holds. 164 days to go till next year. Or 65 days till next year. Oh, yeah, 64, because it's 2nd of January. Now, that big, big build up, and it's all over. I just see a woman in the shop, and she was like really stressed. I said, How do you feel? She said, Oh, yeah. She said, It's only the 2nd day in January. Murphy's birthday next week. 
20. What a big milestone for you, at. So, hopefully, I'm not going to be working so we can all go out for dinner. I've always taken my children on their birthday out for dinner. Even if it's just McDonald's or Burger King. But I'll normally take them to a restaurant. And I've always done it. And it's one thing that I do like to try and do. But as they get older, they're going to want to do their own, their own thing. So, we'll see. So, anyway, I'm doing a spin class tonight. Or, uh, this evening and tomorrow and Thursday personal training on Friday and then another spin class on Saturday so four spin classes this week but two of them are f half an hour and two of them are 45 minutes and the 45 minute one that's pretty good and the person who's doing the half an hour Never had them before, so we'll see. But I just thought I'd just try and get that in before I go to work. And uh, have fun. Look after yourself. Stay healthy. Stay fit. Or if not, just enjoy yourself. Do what you want to do. Speak to you soon. Love you lots. Bye-bye.